After a lovely bomb from Jorge Soler, the Marlins are tied up at four going into extra innings. De La Cruz strikes out. They intentionally walk the next guy, putting two on for Cooper. He swings in the first pitch, going pretty far. Looks like it'll be caught. Nope. He bumbles it in a huge way, letting Arise come home to score. What a massive break. Especially because after they walked the next guy, it was Jacob Stallings. Now, if you know anything about Stallings, he's not the most talented woodsman. And sure enough, he grounds into a double play. That's his specialty. Everyone heads back to the dugout. What can you do? At least you got the one run. But Skip knows better. He says, hey, challenge. Challenge, please. Home plate. As in, he thinks the catcher missed home plate. The umpire goes to announce the challenge, and we get this wonderful little piece of history. Really Miami's look challenging the out call at home plate. The Marlins are going to challenge that. They got their heads up their ass. The guy is so sure of himself. He lets the whole stadium know. Idiots, of course he was out at home plate. And wouldn't you know it, they check it on the video board. The foot slips right off the plate. Second absolute miracle for the fish in that inning. You just have to love this guy, too, the umpire, looking right at the catcher. He gets a great look, but I guess his head was inside of his anus. After review, the call is overturned. The runner is safe. The run will score. You truly feel like that made a huge impact in the game, kind of helped us in that extra innings to get those extra run support. Garrett Hampson comes up, you know, next batter after we overturn a play at home plate, get that extra out in our favor. Uh, Garrett Hampson comes up big, gets two, get two RBIs on that play to kind of extend our lead in extra innings and then really put the pressure on the Angels. You know, in a series that we end up sweeping, going our way, that was a huge one for me. Let us know what you guys think about this situation. I love this one comment talking about the Mendoza boys. I try to cut the guy some slack, but Gene and Stallings definitely belong on the cover of Double Play magazine. Always appreciate the dialogue. Thanks, everybody.